Hey guys, your average reviews here. I hope everyone's having a great day or night. I'm here today with the Workos FC12. I've got three different varieties here, and as you may have noticed, one with a short tube. Um, the reason I have these other two here, even though they don't have batteries in them currently, is just to show you this light does come in a lot of different colors. This is the stock tube. The grip is very nice. There is a tail cap and the side button. This is used to change your modes and this is to turn it on and off. There is a pocket clip and of course the USB-C charging port. So this light comes like I said in a lot of different colors, purple, red, gray, etc. Just, you know, a bunch. This one being my favorite design with the blue splatter on black. Give you a nice close-up. And of course the short tube. This is the one I, I like to use just because it's more pocket friendly but you do lose the pocket clip, which is unfortunate. Now this flashlight has a pretty tight hotspot. I wish um, I would focus a little bit better, but you can see the hotspot here is pretty small, but it expands pretty rapidly over distance. So it is very useful for looking in the yard or going on walks. It, it has, a feature where if you hold down the side button and push the tail cap you get the moonlight mode which is one lumen and they say this will run for 400 hours which is just insane i don't know what it will run off of on the short tube you can use a 16340 or an 18350 it is designed for an 18350 though so i imagine that time would be cut in you know, 33% or maybe even less. So again, you've got the moonlight mode. This is what I believe to be, let me just check here, the eco mode, which is 10 lumens, and this will run for 230 hours. You've got low, which is 80 lumens, and this will run for 21 hours. Medium, is 300 lumens and they claim this will run for 7.5 hours the high mode is 800 lumens and will run for 3.5 hours i think the medium and higher more than enough for most things you'll be doing uh, at least for me and then of course if you double click you get turbo which is 2000 lumens and they claim that will run for 2.5 hours on the 18650 batteries. Um, of course, if you triple click, which I won't do on the video, uh, you have access to strobe, SOS, and the beacon mode, which just you know lets out a blink of light every few seconds so you can be seen. Um, it's not something I really use very often, but it is there since it is a tactical flashlight that might be useful for some people. If you noticed when I turn it on, this button does light up. The green means the battery is above 30%. If it's red, that means it's below 30%. And if it's blinking red, that means you want to charge it probably pretty soon. The flashlight will cut off if the battery is below 2.7 volts. And I did a few runtime tests where I turned the light on, put it down, and set a timer for five minutes, and I took the temperature and the battery voltage. Um, of course, I charge the battery between each test using the built-in USB-C port. Uh, with a 16340 battery, it was 45.4 degrees Celsius or 113.6 degrees Fahrenheit. And the battery was at 3.81 volts. The high setting was 32 0.4 degrees Celsius or 90.4 Fahrenheit and the battery was at 4.03 volts 
with an 18350 cell um, on turbo it was 44.0 degrees celsius or 111.2 degrees fahrenheit and the battery was at 3.85 volts and on high it was 39.0 degrees celsius or 102.2 degrees fahrenheit and the battery was at 3.95 volts and of course using the stock um, tube with an 18650 that came with the flashlight on turbo it was 46.3 degrees celsius or 115.3 degrees fahrenheit and the battery was at 4.08 volts and on high it was 43.9 degrees celsius or 111 degrees Fahrenheit, it's 111.0 to be exact, and the battery was at 4.09 volts. Now, you can purchase this flashlight, um, and the three main places I always mention are the official website, Workos. With the battery, it is $25.99. Without the battery, it is $22.99. And of course, if you want this nice little short tube, which if you have some um, 18650, I'm sorry, 18350s or 16340s laying around, you should definitely pick one up for $1.99. I mean, it's a no-brainer in my opinion. And on AliExpress, this uh, flashlight with the battery is 2622, and without the battery, it is 2446. And on Amazon, the most expensive, but the probably the quickest shipping. Um, it is $37.99 with a 10% coupon currently. I, I really do like this flashlight personally, and I do think it is worth those prices, um, especially if you're looking for something that is very bright and, like I said, you can see very far, as you'll see in these beam shots I'm about to show you. Um, that's about it for this flashlight. I hope you guys enjoy. Uh, up next, I'll just show you a quick few beam shots. Unfortunately, it was really late at night, so I was trying not to disturb my neighbors by being too loud or shining the light for too long, but I hope it gives you a good idea of what this flashlight is capable of. And as always, um, I hope you guys have a wonderful day or night, and just know you're appreciated. Hey guys, I'm outside here with the Workos FC12. I'm going to show you a couple quick beam shots. Right now I have it on the lowest mode. Uh, not moonlight, just low. I can see the shed and the buildings around me. If somebody or something was out here, I would be able to see it. The low medium mode, you can start to see the buildings. On the camera, that is. And then the medium high mode is very clear. I can see about 150 feet out there. And then on high, I can see about 200, maybe 225 feet, maybe even more. And then on turbo, I can see easily about 250 to 300 feet, pretty easily. And that is the Workos FC12.